again uh, as you see like okay so this So this 177, this is the general currency conversion, and this 177, okay, so this is a general currency conversion here, and so, uh, like, okay, so you recorded this where? You recorded this to Snapper, right? That is, that is what I see, you recorded yes. this to Snapper. Now, mm -hmm. so here, if, but it is not Snapper, so what it is, how do you understand that, okay, what it is? In order to understand what it is, where you need to go. Give me one more minute here. Okay, so all right. So in order to understand okay, what it is, you need to go to uh, here. Okay. So you see what happened here. 177. So 177 went out of the USD PayPal. USD PayPal. And that became 156 euro. And then this 156 euro was paid to accelerated IT service. How you know that um, these transactions like 177 and 156 were related? Because from here you can see them. Like, okay, this is, this is how exactly PayPal works. So uh, 177. So you see, like it, it, it clearly mentions that okay, the description is general currency conversion. It is not a payment. It says general currency conversion, and it is a negative. Like it is a withdraw, withdraw from USD. It is a withdraw from USD, right? Yes. Okay. And here you see it is a deposit in euro, and it also says general currency conversion understand that yes okay. yes and also uh, uh let me just check if we have uh one thing here uh we have like uh, one password. okay so Let me just check one thing here. Uh, okay, so I'll, I'll go Let me just real quick see if I can access PayPal. Sometimes I can, sometimes I cannot. So because it says BD, so maybe. But let me just try. So why are we doing that now? I'm, I'm trying to show you that, okay, uh, if, like the thing I, I just told you that, okay, like I'm sure that this, this is this paper, like this transaction is like this went to 177, this became 156 here. So this is what exactly I am going to show you, like from the paper website, mm -hmm. like, you, because you asked me that, okay, how do I know that? So like, this is what I'm showing you, like, how do I know this, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So just give me one more minute here. Uh, bear with me. So search transaction, and you can search this to transaction ID. So this is the transaction ID that we have, and you see like what happened here. So like this hundred and fifty, this hundred and seventy-seven, right? It was done. Mm -hmm. This became hundred and fifty-six euro, and then this was paid to accelerated IT, right? You see mm -hmm. it here. It was paid to accelerated IT. Now, where have we recorded that? We have recorded that to here. Here is the record. You have recorded that to Snapper as advertising, right? This is not mm -hmm. correct. It should be what? It should be accelerated IT and hosting, right? Yeah. Um, so we don't have this. Yeah, we don't have this uh, description in our PayPal uh, PayPal uh, statement, right? Accelerators. Absolutely, we have. Absolutely, we have. If you go here, then you see like this against this 156, we have this description accelerated IT. 
Where? Right here. Right, right here. Oh, I see on the on, on on. So this is okay. This is uh, Excel. Okay, in Excel uh, statement. Okay. Absolutely. So you have this statement. So, uh, okay. So I, it looks like I have to just follow not only okay, but this and also, Excel. And also, also we have another case where we we know that okay, this is going to be paid. People. So this hundred and fifty six. We know that this is accelerated IT, right? Here, you see the invoice. Mm -hmm. So then you should, you should like this should come to your mind, like okay, what happened? Like, uh, did I record this correct or not? So you need to like come here, and then you need to check, like okay, did I record this correct or not? So this hundred and fifty-six. Uh, okay, so now, now this is okay. I, I corrected this. So hundred and fifty-six hosting. Uh, this is accelerated okay. IT, and so save and close. Okay, so uh, now so this, this is done, right? So, so yeah, so we just matched uh, yeah, those so, payments to those invoices. Yeah, so no, not all of them. So this 156 is done now. Uh, like 177, so this, this is done now, 177, okay, and so where is this 177? This one. Okay, so now I know that if I have this general currency conversion description in this statement, I know we paid it in euro, and I just go ahead and check Excel sheet, and in Excel sheet, I will go ahead and find name uh, of the vendor. That's correct, absolutely. Okay, so it's always like that, as I understand, if by general currency conversion, it's mean that we paid in euro and uh, it's mean that... Uh, yeah, like if it is general currency conversion, that means we have not paid in dollar. Now, yes. it does not necessarily... And it's mean that no, it does not foreign vendor... Yeah, it does not necessarily mean that we paid in euro. Maybe it is in euro. Maybe it is in Pino, yeah. Pino Peso. Maybe it is in right. pound sterling. Yeah. So, Whatever it is, it will show. It will show to us on the yes. on the paper on the statement here. You can see like okay, you yes. can see the detail, and also on the statement here, like the paper statement here, yeah. you you have a different version. Like okay, so here dollar ends, and then you have the euro. So here also you can see them on the statement. Uh, I'm sorry. Where where is it? On the statement itself, the PDF statement. Oh, statement. oh, oh, yeah, 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 that's what, that's why you mean, okay. Okay, so this is how, so now what we're doing, like, uh, uh, we, we know that, okay, these this transactions, the rest of the transactions, maybe there's something wrong, so I'm, I, I'm going to reconcile them all, and once I'm done, I'll let you know, then we can review the other bookkeeping, the, the ledgers and everything, and then we can go from there, okay? Okay. All right. Sounds good then. Thank you so much, Shams, for uh, explaining this to me. Yeah. It is uh, it is a good point, and now I will remember. Okay, sure, no problem. And yeah, thank you very much, and I'll, I'll talk to you soon. Uh, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. sounds good. And, and meanwhile, maybe what we can do, you can just you can just review, I'll borrow like whatever you have done. You can review everything so that when I'm reviewing it, like it's better that you catch the error before I review and catch it. Maybe it's better that you catch the error if there is any. You review the other accounts and just, just review it. Okay? And uh, by this time, I'll be done and then we, we can review it together again. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. Thank you.